walking in the rain. Good morning, it's DJ Debs, and today I'm on the train up to Sterling to my friend Christina, who's all the way from Hong Kong. That's all I can say right now. I'm on the train, eating at breakfast. <laughs> Off to Sterling. now I'm in Sterling and I'm just figuring out where is town and I'm saying this because it's a little bit foggy still I can't see the castle so hopefully I'll find something to do in a moment and I'll see Christina in the afternoon okay now this helps where to go I found all the shops let's go shopping this shopping center is Sterling the Thistle shopping center is bigger than the East Gate in Ness I don't get lost. I really, really want it. Fantastic. Flying Tiger. Look what I got for Ryan. He's a British film geek, so I had to get him this. Action! That's a big unicorn and koala. Let's have some fun. Ooh, let's have some fun in here. Okay, I'm gonna guess who's who. Aladdin. Um. Oh. This is Pots. Just a duck. Or. Oh, Zillow! I'm just gonna go in here. Creepy and shopping center. I'm a little bit scared, I'm so. I have no idea where I'm going. It's raining, so I've got myself an umbrella. But we just love the rain in Scotland. No! I'm gonna head to Smithton Arts Gallery Museum. Okay, where did the rest of his sword go? I just noticed that. Look. Something's not right. <laughs> I remember Christina texting me saying, oh, we can go for a lovely walk. But she's in college. She didn't realize it until yesterday she was in college. So, bummer. <laughs> but I must say the walk is really lovely, like she said, because there's so many places to walk, and when you walk, you can just look up and see how high the castle is. And it looks so high. I could go up there, but I think I got the wrong entrance. And the rain is really annoying me. It really is. You may kind of like hear it now on my umbrella. So, I'm not gonna go up there. I think it's terrible to go in the rain up to Sterling Castle. So I'm gonna go and see if the Smith Art and Gallery Museum is free. Fingers crossed. Let's begin the tour, shall we? Quiet museum with a lot of information on the history of Sterling. But it's not that quiet until you get to the clocks. You can tick tock. Now this is a doll's house given to Miss Grace Gavin and it looks really beautiful. I love the, the design of it. There's so many rooms, the drawing room, the music room, bedrooms. It's so big, isn't there a side? It looks so big and wonderful. Now this room's the biggest. You got a little horse. <laughs> a cot for the bed. It looks really beautiful. It's the biggest I've ever seen in my life. Look, they even had a swimming pool. You don't get that in a lot of dollhouses. I'm gonna make this in Minecraft. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Is that real? Yeah. Oh! 
interesting museum. Got creeped out by a bat and a cat. And that two things rhyme. But really interesting museum. Quiet right now, but I just want to left, it got busy. So right now I'm gonna leave and head back to town and find Christina. There's a garden here? I think I found it. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb. Fleece was like a snow. Believe it or not, I only practiced that for five minutes. Do you think I got the right tune? If you don't think I did, come down Sterling and try out for yourself. Or send me a clip of you playing the keyboard. You go to home or at school. This is Christina. Hi. And you're having hot chocolate, aren't you? Yes. I and I'm having iced raspberry tea. You try first. Okay. Do I try this? No, you're, no, you're okay, hot chocolate this. first. Do you want to try mine? No. You sure? You got the hot chocolate, so you try it. <laughs> okay. How is it? Mm, it's creamy. It's sweet. It's really good. I like it. Okay, I'll try my iced tea. <laughs> Okay, how is it? Tastes a lot of water than raspberry, but it's good enough. It's Do you have to stir it? No, it's just just like water. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't taste it, but it's good enough. Yeah, it's good enough. I'm just about to leave, but I've been hanging out with Christine, and we've known each other for like <laughs> seven years now. <laughs> that yeah. long? Yeah. I was there like both twenty. 10 and 11, I think. She's been back and forth between like Inverness, mm -hmm. Nern, Sterling. She yeah. lives now in Sterling for four, four years yes. now. Yeah. No, well, <laughs> no, you, you know what I mean? For like the next four years, you'll yeah, be living yeah. in Sterling. Mm -hmm. Sterling. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. what are you studying? Uh, English. English. Linguistic. And She's philosophy. that. She's that good at English. No. You are. No. No, trust me, you are that good at English. <laughs> like, you're so Kinda. good. Like, I think you understand every single word I've said today. Mm -hmm. She's that good. Ah, I've been improving. <laughs> You're improving very yeah, well. Thank you. Even her art has been improving very well. I mean, look at the oh, her, look yeah. at the, look at her uh, phone. Yeah. She made that. <laughs> and there's my little signature. Yeah. So pretty. Yeah. So, I have an online shop selling all kinds of stuff like that. What's the website? Uh, the website is spreadshirt.com. No, I'll look it up and then yeah, put it like yeah. a bit alone. <laughs> but I, yeah. we've had a great time talking. We've talked mm -hmm. about like movies, yeah. back stuff back in Inverness, <laughs> yeah. um, <laughs> art. Yeah. <laughs> what else are we talking about? Uh, wait. Dude. Passion for fashion. We look yeah, at her. Yeah. Look at her earrings. <laughs> My ears. They're so cute. <laughs> uh, I think that's what we've been talking about. Yep. I have to go and catch a train. Okay. Yeah, I'm I'll gonna miss you. There. Ah. I'm so glad to see you today. Me too. Yeah. I mean, if I didn't, this is the reason I came to Sterling to mm -hmm. see her, mm -hmm. or else I would be bored. <laughs> My feet are so wet, soaking wet. Yeah, you're still having wet feet. <laughs> I need to change my shoes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you actually enjoying like the weather here in Inverness or not? Mm, in yeah. Scotland. Yeah, kind of. Actually, it's quite similar to Hong Kong because we always spring there oh. but not like the cold but yeah we we were like hot and wet but here it's like cold and wet so so cold yeah I know don't worry warm up soon yeah I know <laughs> just got back on the train it was great seeing Christine that was a total main reason why I came not to shop to see her I mean she's all the way from Hong Kong she's living in Sterling all by herself had to see her it's great that I saw her so much things and we had like I had like an hour to spare just to see her so good now I'm heading back to Inverness and finish the kiss cam book on the train I got, I got some great stuff you'll see you you'll see them all later promise I'm back in Inverness and I'm off the train in the car to get some hot food chips watching big shot little shot why I eat food. Before I go to bed, I'm going to finish reading this book because I can't wait until tomorrow to finish it. I want to finish it today because I'm just so into it right now. But before I read the book, I want to show you what I got in Sterling because I did promise you guys. I got a poster of the Fantastic Beast. I have no idea where to put it. Like, I don't know if I should hang it up. 
I don't know which posture I should take down. I'm just gonna like hang it somewhere. I have no idea first, so I think it's gonna find me ages to where to put it in my room. I wonder if I'm gonna take a poster down or not and put that one up or leave it. Anyway, fortune cookies I got. I got an umbrella as you know. It's still good. Usually when you get an uh, umbrella from Poundland, it breaks within the day you got it. But luckily this one is still alive. Thank goodness. Uh, I've got a book from Oxfam. This book is called Great Answers to Touch Interview Questions. Basically it's a good book when you're hunting for a job. So I thought this could help. Um, I've got a present for Ryan. Because it's coming up to Easter. I do Easter presents. My auntie started it, and the reason my auntie started it, because she's so far away, so we thought this would be a nice thing to do. So it's like when it's my cousin's birthday, or when it's Christmas, or when it's Easter, we give presents to each other. So for Ryan, I got him this, and Groot. And he does like his films, and he does like Marvel, so I got him this for Easter. For me, I know he's getting me a dress because he was supposed to get me that dress for Christmas but they sold out so he's getting it for me for Easter and I'm getting him that for Easter sorry if you're watching this and you already found out what your present is but I know what my present is so what? might as well tell Ryan what his present is he's watching this hi honey <laughs> and I got some pillow hoops but I didn't eat them my way I should have and that's all I got in Sterling I'm so glad I saw Christina but right now it's like what Almost 9 o'clock. I'm going to quickly stop the vlog here. Read this book. Hopefully to be in bed before 11. I doubt that because it takes me forever to read. But oh, I just really want to finish this book because I'm so into it. Like I don't want to wait till tomorrow. I want to finish it today. I'm too busy tomorrow. I've got to teach on Friday. So right now. This is the end of the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up, comment below and subscribe. And check out Christina's page to see her fabulous artwork. Anyway, it's been Danger Debs. The opposite of danger. Bye guys!